vaccines, including the polio vaccine, are safe and effective. The ministry maintains that the reactions reported after the polio vaccine was administered from October the 2nd to the 6th, 2024, were coincidental and resolved over time. And speaking during a press briefing on Saturday, Health Director General Dr. Patrick Amorth emphasized that health events occurring around the time of vaccination are not necessarily caused by the vaccine itself. Parents have been encouraged to bring their children for the second round of the polio vaccination campaign, taking place from November the 9th to 13th, 2024. And investigations by the Kenya National Vaccines Safety Advisory Committee revealed that out of 23 reported cases, 16 were classified as non-serious, 7 as serious, and 18 as coincidental. We targeted 3.9 million children aged 0 to 59 months and we are able to reach 3.7 million giving us a coverage of 95 percent with counties like Busia and Machakos exceeding their targets or by more than 102 to 104 percent therefore I want to call upon all Kenyans and reassure Kenyans of the safety of the polio virus and to clearly indicate that the two deaths that happened in the first round of the campaign were not directly attributable to the vaccination process, rather they were coincidental events and not directly linked to the immunization uh, campaign that we carried out one month ago. And we did confirm that in none of these children was there any direct relationship or link with the polio vaccine. Many times when people die, as we may be aware, we are quick to blame an occurrence. We were careful to be sure that uh, if there was a link, we established. And in promoting the health care, our emphasis is uh, to ensure that children receive wholesome care, which includes uh, preventive um, health, we also do promotive health and as well as curative. The slain 